you may think that I have too many tabs. However, for some strange reason, my computer isn't really slowing down. And sure, it takes up lots of memory, but oh wow. However, I'm not really mostly a computer expert, so I don't fucking know that. However, there's a bit controversy with this YouTuber. People are sending this comments. That's word. That face was supposedly said by this person. It's actually an impersonator. However, some mobile users are unable to access YouTube community posts. Of this is what I think. So yeah. According to this community post, this person <laughs> Some people fell for Kirill Kirk time fans impersonators And do you know who's behind them? Well, I know because I was fucking involved in the Lyft community and in the Roblox side of it. You know this YouTuber, Kirio Koskarakta and Fan UTDP, and this is his main account, gone due to community strikes. Those videos are literally like NSFW-ish pornography videos, like actual sex videos. And he even managed to leak people's email. And also he identify himself as a UTTP. Of course, UTTP members are fucking toxic. UTTP, THG, TC, TSPL, ATSPH. Even uses the leaf symbol as a replacement for you. <laughs> Have you ever realized that? It sounds like assholity. This is the same person who only knows how to enable caps lock. He never talks with caps when he's talking to people who he likes, but he always talks in only caps when he's talking to people who he hates. He's even fetishizing NSFW content. So this person was behind the fake Luigi Fan 2006 account, and not to be, and I not. I really actually hate Jelly Bean. For real. And if anyone says that I like it, then it's probably not me. Even got his videos age restricted due to actual community guidelines. And yes, he makes sex videos out of underage kids. Luigi Fan 2006 is actually fucking 15 years old. And plus, that person, Kyoko's Time fans, made sex videos out of that individual. So he could. Uh, you know, make a fetish video. And yes, this is recorded by Half 93294, but I'm going to fucking give it to LuigiFan2006 by email or like other sources. You thought Twitter was toxic. You thought those. Sexists who call themselves human, who is actually a woman, and who actually sense like all men should die. Yeah, that's the stuff that most Twitter users that are female do that. Like they say, all females must, all males must die. Game are dead.
any other st stupid leftist shit. And then you have the right wing extremists, same as the far left. The far right is also assholes. Like they always are obsessed with Nazi Germany for some odd reason. And they even ship for and they even supported a dictatorship that used to be the government of Germany during World War II. However, I'm not going to tell you who he is, because I bet some people already know it. And plus, those users, you thought they were horrible and shitty persons? Welp, you are fucking wrong. What is this? I see the UTTP icon. I see those sexual videos. And he obviously bashes people's opinions by making sex videos out of people because they do not like Winnipeg's transit system. Like when someone says that they do not like Winnipeg's transit system with an actual reason. He will fucking bash their opinions and says that oh your opinion is rejected one times now. The funniest thing is that some popular YouTubers managed to fail for it. Like literally. Literally, fucking literally. I'm suffering from something that makes me unable to say lots of words. And this person was actually in and the impersonator uses a fucking different provide picture. As this one. This person is actually an impersonator. You can tell by its provide picture. And says one day ago, like most of the time, I usually see him using this profile picture. As the impersonator uses a very old one, like around late 2020 or 2021. And now it's March 2020, fucking two. And I believe 2022 is already a shitty year, just like 2023, if I'm going to predict. This is why I rightfully chose the decision to oppose Kirk Time. Because Kirk Time is a fucking jock. And it's run by a person named Mayan Kirk Guy. If you don't know who is it, he's just an innocent person who makes Vion style videos on Scratch. And previously, he uses Coanimate or Vion. However, his subscription has ended. And he cannot even use Wrapper online. And I don't know what the fuck is Wrapper online. However, when he tries to use Wrapper online, he cannot. Because of an application error. So he uses Beyond as a replacement of Go Animate. I mean, Scratch, of course. And that very same person literally made fake, literally make belly button fetish videos, even out of real life fucking children. If you don't know who the fuck was that, it's this guy. This one is the one who invented Kirk Time. He's the only person who's actually more mature than Kirikos Kirk Time fan, even though this person thinks that cyberbullying is a it's good and justified, like cyberbullying love forever is justified and fucking perfect. This is what he fucking thinks. And this is a fucking belly button fetish video. I wonder how the fuck he, he didn't even get banned from scratch. And here is his extremely bad news, which shows that his YouTube account got actually fucking terminated for pornography and nudity. Like, 
It doesn't even fucking sound like a job because if you look at this shit, it's actually real. The black text says sexual. The black sensor is actually meant to say sexual, but scratch it sounds like NSFW references usually. So they have to fucking censor that shit. Like he. Because he's actually a man. And of course, this is the very same guy who made up, who impersonated this person on, who was a popular Scratch user on Roblox. And I highly doubt that a real LEGO fan tool 6 is interested in lifts. And this one was his Kirk's made up animal pets. This one is his supposed wife or husband. Isn't that strange? And those here are his made up characters that doesn't even fucking exist in real life. And yet he pretends that they exist in real life by fooling people by making fake Roblox accounts. And this is his logo. However, we're unable to show his YouTube channel because he's actually fucking terminated. If you're wondering, there's some old videos of Kirk. This is one of the screenshots of Kirk's old video. And then, this is a video that shows his old fucking channel. Let's see all. Yes, his old fucking channel. It's literally for much. It's literally two years ago. And this is his old channel, like his channel in March, one two thousand twenty. He's supposedly obsessed with fucking Batman. And his latest video is like a numbers list. Even makes a fake lift video. Yet he actually stole that shit. I mean, that person glorified Cyber Greek. And sure, he even overreacted of a crap exploiting video all the way from 2019 and took him six months to make a grand video out of him. At one point, I see his comment saying, Copyright videos by copyright of my videos. However, his account got deleted, so it would be p perfectly safe to re upload his videos. And we call him my shitty uncles. However, the funniest thing is that. There's even a person worse, who is even worse than my career course, even managed to make UTTP account. Even though Kirk supposedly claims to be, he says, go to the community guideline strikes. He makes sexual fetish videos, and now he got lots of community guideline strikes, he even impersonated me to attempt to give myself a bad reputation. So yeah. This is how I speaking. It will be uploaded in the Luigi Fan 2006 video. I mean the channel. So yeah. I should probably email him. So yeah, thanks for watching this basically like 50 minutes waste of time, like it's a 50 minute video that wastes people time just because of me debunking who the fuck impersonated him, and yes, bye bitches, of course.
He's also a fan of me, so yeah, I treat him fucking well. And just be careful of, about Kiryako's Kirk time fan, because if you say something that he fucking hates, you go to full length, including the method of actual cyberbullying. Yes, we're not fucking joking. 